welcome back to Star With Substance and welcome to a, um, a new in video. This is the first of its kind on my channel but I thought I would just show you guys not what my current favourites are but some of the new things that I've either bought or been gifted in the month of July. So we're in August now obviously <laughs> um, but I wanted to show you guys some of the stuff that I've been using in July and a little bit of this month as well. So it's not a favourites video but a new in video. So if you want to see some of the bits and bobs that I've picked up, then please keep watching. So the first item new in in July was this lovely package from The White Company. This was a gift from my very good friend, Karen and um, Lenny, her husband. And it was kind of a, a pre Quangela gift. So um, a gift for my introduction ceremony. So I'd already unboxed it, but I thought, let me do it again for my main channel. Um, so it comes in this lovely gift bag here and it opens up and the box itself looks like this. This is the Seychelles Bergamot Amber and Vanilla Home Scenting Set. Um, so it comes in a box like this. I love the packaging for the White Company and I've never really discussed liking the White Company with her but she kind of just knew that it sort of fit my style which was a very good guess on her part. Um, so it opens up like this. So it comes with a Seychelles candle and um, reed diffuser with the sticks there and a room spray as well. So the description reads, um, like a warm Indian ocean breeze, soothing Seychelles is an evocative blend with notes of rich amber, fresh bergamot and bright orange, warmed by notes of exotic coconut, vanilla and almond. Ugh. Love coconut, love vanilla, love almond. So this is a really lovely gift and I cannot wait to um, try this out. I'm actually going to wait um, and first use this in the new house because we are moving very, very soon. So we just got our uh, mortgage offer back from our bank yesterday. So that means that basically it's all systems are go. We're going to kind of move to, um, well, set a date for exchanging contracts and then completing and then moving so could be the end of this month could be early next month we'll see the next item that was new in that i actually wanted to haul before i went away to uganda was a pair of sunglasses um so i ordered this off a website called i offer which is where i get a lot of my sort of designer dupes um and i wanted these for a long time but i uh wasn't sure if they were going to fit my suit my face or like if they were going to look good or whatever. So I thought, let me get the dupes and see, as I always do, kind of see how I feel about it, see how it wears, see how it suits me. And then later on down the line, when I start to, you know, stack up all my designer goodies, I know what to get and what not to get. So it's a dupe of the Celine, the Celine sort of um, wide, um, wide rim sunglasses. I don't know the model name, but... If you guys have seen these before, you'll probably, if you guys are like fans of Celine, then you'll probably know what these are. Um, so they look like this on. Um, they're definitely sunglasses where you kind of have to have curly hair on, um, because with straight hair, it just makes my whole face really look really small. Um, so yeah, they look also really nice on the top of the head as well. So I took these to Uganda with me, and you would have first seen these on my vlog channel, but I'm really loving them. They've been really good to me in the summer and I love that they kind of cover up all of your face. Um, I do still love aviators. I think Ray-Bans will be my first pair of like proper designer sunglasses, but these I've really enjoyed. The next two items I got in Uganda. So first of which being a book in true style of substance form. Um, got a squeeze of that little bit of substance. So I was on Kampala Road, which is just near where Barclays Bank is, right in the center of town coming from Cafe Java's, which is one of my favourite restaurants in Uganda. If you've been there, comment down below or give the video a thumbs up. Um, the food there is amazing. They do the best milkshakes, best milkshakes I've ever had in the entire world, hands down. My favourite was like this passion fruit milkshake because it's so, it's so fresh and the flavours, the flavours are so like, Oh, I don't know. I don't know how to describe it, but it's like the best milkshake I've ever had in my entire life and it makes me want to go back. Um, so yeah, so outside there, there was a woman selling books on the, um, just like on the, on the road, not on the road, on the pavement. And I picked up this book. So this is um, Increase Your Financial IQ um, by Robert T. Kiyosaki. 
and it says get smarter with your money so it's like so obviously he's the author of the book rich dad poor dad if you guys know about that book which was a childhood favorite of mine and which was the one that kind of really wanted to really made me want to get into property and you know get on the property ladder basically and just better myself in general so i picked this up for i think i paid fifteen thousand shillings which is about three pounds it's obviously a used book but hey the book's a book at the end of the day next item i picked up in uganda was of course my traditional wedding dvd so this is the um introduction ceremony video from start to finish and it's got me and mr man on the front there a copy of this will be going up on my vlog channel as the part two to um the kwanjala vlog so you guys will get to see a shortened version of this on my vlog channel this is an hour and 40 minutes and a lot of it is in luganda so I wanted to edit it in a way that I'm kind of narrating over it, telling you guys what's going on. I'm still waiting for the footage to come through from the video guy, but as soon as I get it, it'll be up on my vlog channel and you guys will get to see what went down. But it was a beautiful day. Um, I'm so thankful to my parents for organising such a wonderful event and I really thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, and yeah, um, so yeah, I got that um, as part of the package with... Um, a photo book that my parents got and another copy of this for my parents. The next item it was a present to myself, actually. It was a uh, post Quandula present to myself. And I've wanted one of these for a very long time. Comes in a Joe Malone bag, so no doubt there's gonna be happy times right in here. So I'm unboxing it for the first, very first time with you guys. I bought it at, um, we stopped over in uh, Istanbul. And so I picked it up in the airport there. Um, for a lot less because of duty free. So let me not blab anymore. Let's just open it and see what's inside. So for those of you who are familiar with German, you probably have guessed by now what this is. It's a candle. Mm, she sprayed it with the scent as well. Um, so it's wrapped in tissue paper, but oh, it looks so beautiful. It's the English Pear and Freesia Scented Candle. Um, and it says Bougie Parfumé. It's very bougie, it's quite bougie, but this is literally, oh, I'm in love with it. I'm absolutely in love with it. I don't wanna burn it until we move into the new house, so I'm gonna wait until we do that, but absolutely stunning. I've always wanted a Jo Malone candle, so this is my very first. And I thought, you know what, I deserve it, I've traveled miles and miles and miles across the globe to traditionally marry this man. Let me buy myself a candle. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I'm really gonna enjoy burning that. And again, this is gonna be one of the scents that I first burn in the new house. Also so. in Uganda, I picked up um, a few gifts for some of my work colleagues and um, my friends. Um, but while I was in that store, it was like a craft store. So they do like really lots of, lots of like cute handmade stuff, like key rings and sandals and necklaces and jewelry and, tops and stuff um but i picked myself up a bookmark um it's a flamingo i have no affinity to flamingos whatsoever but i just thought that this is a really cool bookmark i don't know what it's made out of um but it looks like the kind of thing that will wear quite nicely so i popped that in the book that i'm reading at the moment which is ask and is given and last but by no means least you guys know if um you've watched one of my probably one of my q a videos before or something like that that I've been watching the Glam Twins, um, who are YouTubers, for a very long time, probably since I first started getting into YouTube videos. And they recently released a book, their first book. Um, so it's called The Glam Twins Guide to Longer, Healthier Hair by Kelsey and Kendra Murrell. So had to support because these are the girls that kind of inspired me to really wanna get on YouTube. Um, not just because they're absolutely gorgeous, but because of their, uh, business acumen um, because they're very professional, they're morals, I love their content and I just love the whole brand that they've built behind themselves. So I'm going to be reading this and also because I just want to grow longer, healthier hair. It probably won't get to this length, let's be honest, um, that's what the weeds are for. Um, but I just want my hair to be healthy so um, if you're going to take healthy hair advice from anyone, take it from someone who has healthy hair and very long, luscious hair as well. So. I got that off Amazon. I ordered it early hours of probably like midnight yesterday. 
well today technically and it came this morning so it was pretty quick um retails for $16.95 but I think it was like £12.50 um, or something like that and then plus delivery and it's just got um, lots of tips and advice and a few like pictures and stuff of them yeah it's just really informative so I'm gonna probably read this at some point along with everything else I need to read. Um, so yeah, that's everything that's new in. Um, for those of you who've watched the Quandula video so far, because that's that's kind of like the t the talk of the town on my channel, on my vlog channel, really. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you've enjoyed it. Um, part two is coming tomorrow. So this video is gonna go up on a Sunday. So part two will be up on Monday on my vlog channel. The link, it, I'll link my vlog channel in the description box below so you guys can um, go on and watch that. Uh, or go in and su subscribe so you don't miss part two. I also link the part one video so you guys can go watch that too. Um, really thrilled by the response to it. Um, I'm so glad you guys enjoyed it because I really enjoyed the day as well. Um, and the only other update I have for you guys is just around my filming schedule. So I might have mentioned this in a previous video, but I'm now uploading once a week um, as a standard. So you will definitely always get a video on Sunday. Um, but very often, most weeks, you'll probably also get a video on Wednesday. So sun Sunday and Wednesday as a bonus day. Um, most weeks, I will have two videos a week, but I'm just going to commit to the one day. And then if there is a video up on Wednesday, if there is another video up in the week, it will be up on Wednesday as a bonus. So that's my filming schedule. Sundays for sure, Wednesdays as a bonus. And yeah that's that's basically it subscribe to my channel um if you want to see all my new content i've got um lots more life related topics coming up because i'm going through a lot of life changes moving house getting married all sorts um and um all the usual sort of beauty hair and related stuff like that so um thank you guys so much for all your support thank you to all my existing subscribers for sticking with me for so long and um, yeah, I mean, we're close to 3,000, which is crazy. So I'm really happy about that. Um, if you guys um, don't follow me on my other social media channels, you probably should, because I've been pretty active on Snapchat of late, particularly when I was in Uganda. Um, but yeah, my Snapchat is on the screen. It's just Nadrine Kimanuka. And I'm also on Instagram and I post loads of like outfit pictures and I do lots of sneak peeks and stuff that I'm going to haul or talk about in the video. So it's at, at SWS blog, um, which is the same on Twitter. Twitter, I just kind of randomly like retweet stuff, have little rants, you know, um, send like really like, like send like barrages of tweets to like service providers who don't do stuff on time and hit them up on their social media and my Facebook page. Um, whenever I post a new video on my YouTube channel, if you guys um, miss it on YouTube, I will always post a link to it on my Facebook page, which is Star With Substance. So everything will be linked down below um, for you guys. Um, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for um, sticking around and I will see you in my next video. Bye.